Unit 5 Vietnamese Food and Drink Unit 5 Page 48 Getting Started Activity 1 Listen and read Dad and I are going to the opera tonight and we won't be home until 9pm. You'll have to eat dinner alone. There's some food for you in the fridge. OK. Like what, Mum? Some meat with tofu and some fried vegetables. I'm afraid there isn't any bread left, but you can have noodles instead. Uh, but I usually have rice, Mum. There's some rice left from lunch. Just warm it up. All right, Mum. What is there to drink? There's milk, juice or mineral water. How much milk is there? Oh, I forgot. There isn't any milk left. I'll buy some tomorrow. You can have some orange juice instead. How many cartons do you want? One. No, wait. Two, please. Unit 5 Page 49 Getting Started Activity 2 Match the food and drink with the pictures. Then listen, check and repeat. 1. J Eel Soup Two. F. Noodles. Three. A. Lemonade. Four. B. Green tea. Five. D. Omelette. 6. I. Tofu. 7. G. Turmeric. 8. H. Shrimp. 9. E. Sweet soup. 10. C. Beef noodle soup. Unit 5. Page 49. Getting started. Activity 4. Listen and repeat the adjectives. 1. Bitter. Two. Delicious. Three. Tasty. Four. Sweet. Five. Salty. Six. Spicy. Seven. Fragrant. Eight. Sour. Can you add some more adjectives? Unit 5. Page 50. A closer look, 1. Activity 4. Listen and repeat the words. Pay attention to the sounds O and OR. Soft Pork Salt Hot 
bottle, pot, fork, sport, sauce, rod. Now, in pairs, put the words in the correct column. Unit five. Page fifty. A closer look. One. Activity five. Listen to the sentences and circle the words you hear. One. Can you see the cod over there? Two. It is a very small port. Three. Tommy doesn't like these sports. Four. Where can I find the fox? Five. His uncle was short when he was young. Unit five, page fifty-three. Communication. Activity one. Listen to a celebrity chef, Austin Nguyen, talking about his favourite food. Which food in extra vocabulary does he talk about? Hi. I'm celebrity chef Austin Wynn, and I want to share with you a few of my favourite dishes. One of my favourites has to be sticky rice, because we can eat it in so many ways: with a pinch of salt, with some sliced sausage. Perfect. I eat simply at home, just some fruit and yogurt for breakfast. But if I'm eating out, a wonderful grilled tuna steak is my favourite dish. Delicious. Next, Unit Five, Page Fifty Five, Skills Two, Activity One. Listen to three people talking about traditional dishes where they live. Match the places with the dishes. Are you from near Anne? Yes, I am. Are there any traditional dishes there? Yes, there are. There's a kind of soup. Its name is soup learn. What are the ingredients? Well, there's eel, turmeric, pepper, and some chilies. It's often served with bread. Where are you from? I'm from Da Nang. Can you give me an example of a traditional dish there? Our traditional dish is called mi guang. What are the ingredients? It's made with rice noodles, shrimp, pork, and some vegetables. Are you from Haiphong? No, I'm from Hanoi. What are the traditional dishes in Hanoi? There are a lot. Bang dum is one. Bang dum. What is it exactly? It's fried pastry with red shrimp on the top. Mmm, sounds delicious. Unit five. Page fifty-five. Skills two. Activity two. Listen again. Tick the ingredients for each dish. Some ingredients are in more than one dish.
Are you from Ye An? Yes, I am. Are there any traditional dishes there? Yes, there are. There's a kind of soup. Its name is soup learn. What are the ingredients? Well, there's eel, turmeric, pepper, and some chilies. It's often served with bread. Where are you from? I'm from Da Nang. Can you give me an example of a traditional dish there? Our traditional dish is called mi guang. What are the ingredients? It's made with rice noodles, shrimp, pork, and some vegetables. Are you from Haiphong? No, I'm from Hanoi. What are the traditional dishes in Hanoi? There are a lot. Bang dum is one. Bang dum. What is it exactly? It's fried pastry with red shrimp on the top. Mmm, sounds delicious. <laughs>